Hey guys, I showed you all the shortcut that skips the green room last time. I'm here today to show you a boss cheese spot. This cheese was originally found by the Farron Core. He has a clip where he was up there during the event, so I know this works. I'll link him in the description. Small tip, by spamming jump you can move faster while crouched, allowing you to speed through the second, third, and fourth walls. There are other ways to get an advantage by doing long jumps and skipping platforms and yada yada as well. It's not really necessary though. An effective strategy is actually sniping from the back of the pit you drop down in. You won't get pushed by the taken wall, and you only really have to worry about the darkness ball making it to you. But if you really want a bird's eye view, you can make it above the arena. This does require you to jump in the main area, so make sure to leave a centurion alive when you first start out, so you can make the jumps without taking too much damage from enemies, and so that the bosses are not out yet. After one or two of you have made the jump, you can have the third shotgun some blights for your field of view. If you are doing the 400 version, you should bring your Whisper and change to it before the boss room so you get some power ammo for it. Having a top-down approach should give you a good sightline for scout rifle and snipers. The Polaris Lance is also a good option. Warlocks can make it with Strafe Glide or Balance Glide with little to no mobility. Titans should switch to High Jump with Lion Rampants, and Hunters should use Stompies with High Jump. The more mobility you have, the easier the jumps will be. Cheese forever, Guardian. <laughs> 